Tech nearly actually caught trying to cross behind his eyes. I'm not sure if Delzig even noticed him there. Yeah, they did, yeah. The paint uh -oh. shell's gonna force him out here. Or at least do a lot of damage. There's a stack on this side of the map, and I'm looking at the flank Dapper. If you can get the timing right towards Mailroom. Max. Timing, let's see how it works out. There it is, Dapper's timing could not have been better. Kesnit does at least take down six, so he's opened up the gateway towards it. Oh, Tens couldn't make much of that one, and they're just about keeping this in check for crew. One, one by one game. they come, and one by one they fall. Shazam still trying to make something of this, and this is gonna shut down. Crew are right back at the door. Again, crew looks so comfortable in some of these rounds where they were just death ball, just strength in numbers. Oh, yeah. Brute force their way onto site. Now again, coming into this buy round here, I did see Dapper already had the Viper's Pit available. Sick mm -hmm. had decent progress towards the res. Oh he actually my. has it now. Elsewhere, again, Tens not really had a say in any oh of these my. rounds so far. The Operator online, oh but uh, again, he needs an orb and two kills or three That's kills to have the Blade Storm to fall back on in the next round. If Sentinels lose this, and 700 credits here, everything invested here. And we're all tied up, 8-8. Eight, eight. And this is the big one. This is the round that can define it. We have to wait and see who's going to be able to claim it, who's going to take that step forward. Ten's going to be forced back here, not going to have his own way with that B main push. I'm going to be noted here for a second time. It's Klaus and Co. will actually peel away from this. Now, the only real option here is they something to... so much presence. Yeah. Uh. I say, the only option here is to call this audible and find They've a gap that might have like left this. open here towards ropes, but... A main, not really feasible right now. I don't now. like this hey, at all. How do you clear tens now? I'm not entirely sure why Shazam's been pulled here. No, I'm not too sure myself. Unless they've heard a step or they've been trying to give this a you know, look away. Nags it, maybe make a little noise where he is. Who knows? I mean, tens and sick are committed. They're, they're playing so close here. They're almost committed to this hold at first contact. I've this is got your trail. actually so dangerous. Here come the Seekers. That was maybe the intention to try and push Tens away from the angle, and it works well enough. The double pump will at least get them a step towards the side, but Tens still lingers, Welcome still lurks around the side of these walls. You can see the utility thrown in. Sick by his side, and the rotations are in. Spike yet to go down. It's still being cleared towards the back of the site. Damage is there, but there's the lurk. Comes on in, nags it behind enemy lines. But it's Kesnet as well. They're both able to double down on this down to Sick. Dapper and Shazam. Spike in, and they're all locked towards the site. One a little further away. That's Dapper. Red is going to be considered, but the divide comes in now. Shazam finding Mazzino. Sick going to be working on, his way spin that. the other side of this. There's still a player waiting yeah, for anyone to step on it's through. He punishes tens and Why? Dapper and Sick Last looking down the barrel no of the gun. Way. Crew against so many odds right now. Still able to do this. Sick trying to work a way in. It's done for here. Delzik gets the punish and Crew take the lead. Need that <laughs> and it echoes around the arena. That's a huge round here. Again, they've already done the hard work. They've done the legwork on this comeback. They tied things up. Nag's a key component there to backstab Tens. Oh you can see him. He's God. almost like, how? Oh how God. am I dying from heaven? And this game is The timing you. on that hit there. And again, it, it's four strong to B main. Like I said, I have Shazam. a headache. I, I, I don't know what the com was oh there, God. but he's pulled over towards A. And actually, oh crew, the, the timing is perfect for, for fuck's them. Sakes. This should be 10. This, this should be 10 on the board. Unless something untowards happens or a couple of mad shots come oh, out, which, this. hey, find a little corner, find a little cubby and see what you can get from it. <laughs> oh, you get nothing <laughs> They're from wise it. to it. They're so aware. Oh, this is looking like heartbreak could be on the cards. But for now, still, still going to have a little look. Doesn't find much for it. Gets a little bit of information. And a calming of the nerves for crew. They get that lead under the belt. Pause there, waiting for the re-aggress, and it does come. Sick punish for it. Sam actually Spike will down, find a response, nice but pictures. don't expect crew to suffer on the back of that potential here to try and retrieve this weapon, Taps maybe. again. He's behind him. If Nagzit wants here. to just sit here, he's the perfect stopper of any rotations. They can take that long path around towards eight. The Klaus has so much control right now. Just mm -hmm. this one position here, and you can see. Massive. Crew will hightail it all the way towards eight. Okay, now actually going to get two orbs towards this showstopper here with the plant. I'm just so surprised that either side has left struggling for answers been here. Uh, having again, more of a feasible to find some damage on the way out here. What do you want to call it? Success. Orbs retrieves I guess a phantom, with attack so it could make things interesting. But Klaus holding just in case. He will be punished for it. Sentinel still go for this. Looks like yeah, at least they're going to explore the possibility. The next step that 
is going to become near on impossible. Delta comfy, and there's Nagzev right there in time. Double digits now found for crew, and panic gonna start hitting Sentinels. There's no two ways to put it to you. I have, we have to be honest about this. 10 to eight, as soon as you see a team reach 10, you know that one issue with money, one individual pop-off from an opponent, it could be over. It absolutely is, and they have such a buffer now with the economy. Sentinels, I, I think, are probably gonna have circa 2K credits behind this purchase across the board. This could potentially be, uh, it's even less, it's 650 credits. With them just investing here and there on some of these save rounds, on, it gets real dicey now. This could be crew to 11 and Sentinel bankrupt. Tenzo wants to be the difference maker, oh but he gets absolutely destroyed. Body down by Kesnit and away we go. Sentinel's first line of Miss defense dash. has been cracked open. Crew take this by the horns. They're going to lean towards A. They've got a lovely split towards it with that late lurk in towards middle from Zeno. But there's still a player here. There's still Dapper. Can Dapper do anything to dissuade this? Sick at least catches that player in mid. That's Mazzino. But the site crunch comes in. Dapper nice. Dapper stands and he tries to deliver. He's done everything to give them a shot yeah. at this. A 3v2. Nags it and Klaus still alive. Still trying to fight with everything they can. But this is all on the shoulders of Dapper until Klaus finally steps up to the goods. Can he find this 1v2? 58 seconds to play with. He wants to get that spike down if he can, but this is so risky. Now going to be closed in on. The wall got dropped. <gasps> oh, he's going to fight Shazam. Oh, oh Zombs. fuck, Zombs. Nice. You needed that so bad. But I've got to say it, without Dapper there, without him finding two kills there, I see that round being Cruz. Oh, yeah. And again, the pace change from Crew. They look so decisive. And Sentinels almost there that... They're confused in the early round. They're, they they back away so deep it allows uh, again tens tries to have a say in this round, but Mike won them. If that. anything, you could say this is crew getting a little overzealous, peeking ahead of that. Sure. But it's got to be said, <laughs> Zoms the only Aww. one to survive. <laughs> so that economy Ooh. again. You brought it right back All to the good. point where Zoms just now have to come out. The Shazam is such still a good guy. Crew. They Man. have 17k Jesus. after this. And bear in mind that by the time they get reset, they get the loss bonus as well. Okay, Sentinels, bit of an uphill struggle such here. Such a good positive mindset. Look pretty good at it, but it's not been what easy. What a good person trying. and trying IGL. Everything you can, but it just doesn't seem to be working. Seven kills on the board, 16 deaths. It's double negative. This oh, doesn't quite find it again. A tag is not enough to take them down. Oh, Nexus right, still stands, it gets healed he up, and he gets the right second now. bite of the cherry. Oof. Slow an approach here from Crew. Again, I think with all this pressure, you can see this conditioning now coming to a head. Shazam actually preemptively rotating towards A. But potential here, Dapper. Be this caught a miss. I think we got this. We got this. Zam's on route. I think they're feeling this out, and rightly so. Definitely again, tasked with down. such a, a, a terrible predicament in front of him. How do I deal with all these players? Do I go anti flash? Do I try and face? <gasps> the time is warning. Nice! Oh, Dapper. Huge, huge, huge! The time come of the man. He will not relent this sight. He keeps finding them value. I can still fall by with a spectre. This left. guy is keeping things together for Sentinels. And four of them stand, but three on the other side, still well geared up, still looking pretty to go. Tens can't quite find what he wanted. Double dips down again, looking to do a bit of chip damage, but it's Delzik lurking away towards heaven. Does he find a bit of timing on this? He does at least get a glimpse of Tens, but he loses the fight. And oh, Dapper yeah. again, that's three. And now all down to Mazzino. Nice! Perfect work from Dapper. I am well beyond impressed with Mike. his ability to hold down this site. Mike is the like anchoring so well. And somehow. He still finds two. Look at this. He Look looks at this. away at the moment they peek. They I think it's because themselves. Shazam baits a little bit of contact. He, he shoulders in the screen there. <laughs> he knows uh, rightly, what he's done. Rightly he so. Yeah, it's it's the second oh round now. Oh my god. He, he, he has kept them in check. Yeah. These two rounds Ooh. are his alone. Yes, the rest of the he's boys are there. He's keeping us in the yes, game. He saw Shaz with a little bit of a shoulder peek, trying to pull that attention. Ooh. But I'm going to just give that to my Dapper straight away. His hurting. presence on this map, those lurks through on B main, all of these moments have been essential to keeping Sentinels in this matchup. If that wasn't the case... We're looking at a completely different scoreline right now, 100%, altogether. 100%. And you think about it, actually, even if they go out 6-6 on the first half, you think about Cruz start here in the second. Sentinels don't have the lifeline of uh, effectively. Yeah, they've got two rounds in this half so far, and they've both been on the back of Dapper. An opportunity here for Sentinels potentially to turn the tides. I 
again, what's what, what what's the next step from Crew? Well, yeah. They've looked fantastic in some of these quick pieces. Well, they've dealt with all the front line, right? Tens, not finding that early impact. They're not being able to get those you know, mid peaks that they want to. It's hard to depend on someone like Dapper time and time again, but he has delivered in two rounds. But surely that will come to a close. And speaking of come to a close, the money will eventually be taken away from them. A little bit of an adjustment as well. You see Dapper over towards B site now. He does have the Vipers pit available. Sure. We're going to throw that down and maybe lean towards mid and eight, which would suit. Because we can see what's set up here from crew. Expecting that Viper wall to go up as soon as the barrier drops here. And that's going to be a key indicator for Sentinels. But I don't think they can really back out of this. Guess it's just going to dive on in. Can they clear that corner? Back by Pillar, who just sends it. He loses life. Soms from up on top by the rafters. Excuse me, down by Pillar. The flash comes in. Mazina with a punish. And again. Look at the pace coming out from Kuru's work this time, and maybe the magic man himself, Dapper, ain't here. He can't do much about this. The ult comes up on the other side. And this is going to burn up. The decay is so much before they even get to screens here. Sick fires now. Dapper oh. versus Delzik. What is going on? Against the odds, they're still doing it. Dapper, he turns up on sight. He still gets two. And Sentinels somehow get 11 on the board. I cannot believe what we just saw. Mike. Crew found everything they need to on the way in. Actually, even uh, the showstopper just getting traded Mike. out. No oh value whatsoever. They find an entry onto Zom. This game they get a has bit, which, deducted like I said, 10 years off so my much fucking HP lifespan. On the way back in. And somehow. Like this entry looks perfect. And then Dapper just had other plans in mind. They trade three for one in as many seconds. That is absolutely insane from Sentinels. And it's been a while since we've been able to look at Sentinels and say every single player can step up and deliver. And right now we're seeing a little bit of that magic, something that makes you believe in the site. Because oh, now, they've been doing everything right. They've been getting on the site. They've been getting the plants. And, but still, they lose in that retake scenario. It's unbelievable to imagine. But 10 to 11, the money now coming to the close for crew. They still have a purchase here. But it's what comes after this. What's that next layer? Can they somehow get past the end boss, the final boss, Dapper? As Zoms this time will try and take up that mantle, sit himself towards A in case another A piece comes down. See Shazam playing pretty deep on Heaven here again, respecting that wall initially from Klaus. No real contact found anywhere just yet. Kesnick got himself tucked up into mail. I never I'm thought a fucking video game can make me so nervous, chat. Yeah, one of the slower oh my rounds God. we've seen out of crew now. See what how a world we are living in. <laughs> it plays a little more to what we'd say. Look what the fuck? Yeah. Round, so yeah. we'll see I'm like acting as though I have literal, like a literal a gun back to pointed to my head. Dapper. Catches the glitch. Careful, wall, there goes the wall, and there goes the player. Mazina with an excellent trade, a crucial one at that. Quick flash as well. Dapper going to have to fall away and respect this, but it still looks like left. an A piece is coming in. They're going to find themselves a 4v2 here, Lauren. They are, but Straight away, this rope's ro rotation comes through. Okay, Shazam up by rafters, one tuck towards the back of sight. And there's the first contact. It's good for nice, Shazam. Nice, Shazam. Nice. It's great for Shazam. Fine. Finding two, but they do finally clear him. But there's that next layer. Dapper now gone. 12 seconds left. Zoms needs to hold this together. Nine seconds now. They're still finding the way to the site. Spike going down. And it's Tens, the man, the myth, and pretty much the quiet legend right now. He's done for. Mazzino. What a time to find four. Uh, 11 11. It's as close as it can get. I am so stressed. Insane. They get oh a, a great reactive round there from crew as well they feel that Ooh. pressure back finding that trade on sick in b heaven shazam actually goes huge and finds two kills there again a little bit sloppy on the way out from crew which we credited their fundamentals again these scrappy fundamentals time and time again in some of these rounds so bad for tyson he hasn't found his footing this game they answer back sentinels it's now with a few rounds that momentum again you can't really take too much away We'll get a full purchase here. Zom's actually down on the I don't even have any connection to these players. I don't know them personally, so am I acting like Rifles this again? Across the board. Nags Dude, I know all of these pe people no personally. Available for crew. <laughs> like, what a series. This is a lot. What an absolute treat this has been between What a blessing. Two. Yeah. And again, I, I think I, I, I can speak for a lot of people. You look at this and you think with Cruise International record, Sentinels come into this and you're looking at a 2-0. You see the map beat and you think, oh, 100%. there's a chance. But yep. then, Fractor goes one way, Haven goes completely the other. Yep. It's, and this is something that I think, uh, arcing back to the desk, arcing back to what we said at the start, especially Valo is highlighting it, that, hey, there is a world in which this can fall apart. 
and a couple of those conditions didn't get met instantly, but they slowly built in. And I think being very fair to crew on paper here, no one expected him to go this deep against Sentinels, really. Not in this way, not in these rounds, crew, not in this form. I think it's fair to say crew haven't shown us enough in other series to, to, to make for us, us to realistically think we're going to be here. Map 3, 11, 11. <laughs> Uncharted territory. We go again, three play stack from Sentinels towards A, and they're getting aggressive on the defending side, but Klaus, he's got a feeling behind this. He's read it perfectly, and he punishes Dapper Collected. The second, no, sick with the trade, and the res comes out. They've Perfect. cleared that A site, but they're gonna respond in kind towards B, but the utility is gonna hinder this quick reaction that looks like Crew would have wanted. Perfect way to play around the res here. So late on in this half. Zom's in 10 though. Gotta deal with this pressure on the B. Actually, they're straight onto site here. Yeah, but they haven't quite crested yet. Ten still catching that cross, still going to be doing some damage to try and wrap towards the pillar. Delta finds six, and now he's on his own, and now he's been deleted. They now know pressure comes in from further afield. Zoms gets cleared at the back of the side, but Dapper still closing in. Has to relent away from the Seekers, has to accept that he has to peel away, but he does a little bit of chip damage towards the Xeno. And now the 2v2 flash comes in, but he's going to tuck himself in towards the back side of that box. Nags One enemy remaining. <gasps> they Wait, trade out. They traded? And now Nags it. This guy's have been having a nightmare of a Dropped series. A rifle. But now is the time to come alive. And Dapper on the other side. Two beasts in this one. Dapper! Oh, no way! Nags it's won it! Nags it takes the corner. He takes the fight. And he Match takes the round. Match series elimination point for a crew. Sentinels now. Back. The perfect start. Yeah, the perfect start. Like I said, the way you want to see a team play around Look at res, this. it's it's three strong. The swing oh, out. Oh, the adjustment. Oh, it's clean. Nags it's it. clean. We said he had to try and rework that mentality. Map one was rough for him. He had a tough series. He's re remade himself. Look at the purchase. Hi, Pocket. We about to see Sentinels potentially sent home. By crew. By crew. Now the per the, the money isn't great either though for crew. Like, look at that money. It's still not ideal. It can be fashioned. It's, it's, it's Light armor and a rifle. That's yeah. all I'm looking at there. And there then I is. look at Sentinels. It's a guardian in the hands of tens. Cool. He's got some reps in on it recently, but there's three specters here. Dapper one away from the Viper Spear. That could be huge if he finds a kill. Other than that, it's the Cosmic Divide. Nothing else available for Sentinels. On the flip side, nothing in the back pocket for crew either. Oh, I have a headache. Holy shit. And it all comes down to this, 12 to 11, one team beckoning for greatness, and they're going to flash it. Yes, no yes. way! No yes, way! Destroys three through the smoke. Heartbreak now for Sentinels, as it's all down to Dapper and Sick. Sick fighting with everything, but it is not enough. As Dapper now in the 1v3, the weight of the entirety on his shoulders has to deliver, has to stand tall. He knows what's against him. It's all being poured in. He has to stand and do something, but they're running away. They're not going to mess around for a second. They're leaving him with nothing. He's delivered for Sentinels already this map. Bailed them out, but it's a tall order. A 1v3. Klaus, Nags, and Mazzino alive and kicking right now for crew. Flash comes through. So you know, we're going to pop here. Klaus ready and holding, though. Dapper, it's your time to shine right about now. It's all on you, buddy. Surrounded on all fronts. It's over. It's done with. Crew against all of our expectations, against all odds. Send Sentinels home. I am absolutely speechless right now. Their first international scout to claim is scout. none other than Sentinels. The hopes and dreams of building a dynasty this year left in tatters. A group stage elimination. Tell me this isn't what it's all about. Passion, dedication, their well hearts on the man. line. No one would have said this would have been the outcome. No one in their right mind would have said that. And I'll tell you that for free. But they don't care about the odds. They don't care about predictions or expectations. Oh, they sorry. face them down and they walk away, removing Sentinels. What a moment to prove. Repeat that back to me. Removing yeah. Sentinels. I mean, you can Congrats see on their faces crew. what it means to them. Holy fuck. Holy <laughs> shit. Look at them. This is this huge is for the region as well. For this team in particular, like I said, they have struggled previously. And I mean, Bola even noted earlier, we're having this conversation <laughs> on the way to the studio. You think about who they've lost out to yeah. on an international stage. 
And you come through, Sentinels look so good throughout this series of points, but Crew able to completely flip the rhythm. And it plays out beautifully for them. <laughs> I gotta say it, Nags, Kesnip, absolutely huge here in the final hour. Delzik as well had a fantastic map. And I gotta say, on the side of Sentinels, Dapper was the only one that really, really showed us anything there. I gotta 100%. say, there were a few members, 10s, 9 and 20 on the final map. Just I couldn't have a say. Social media. No. And I think yeah. that's it. It's not, no, it's not down to his here. own misplays, it's down to crew having absolute control in some of these pivotal rounds, Lauren. Ooh, they elevated beyond all beliefs. They took on arguably some's favorites in this tournament, in the lower bracket run. And they made it it's their okay. own. It happens. Right. And now history is theirs in the we making. We win some, we lose can some. They go you know, those how, are very, how, very important. How many teams can they take down? Suddenly, we have no idea. Because this crew is not who we saw at the start of this event or the ones previous to now. They took down someone that, as said, most would have put it all down to in those final moments there. Just, uh... It's beautiful to watch. Can't help but love it, can you? Coach just running up That's on the stage. Bad. I can't quite believe it. I, I, I really can't. What a performance here. <laughs> they, they look oh, like... Just, they look like they just won the finals. <laughs> high for crew. They fought an incredible oh battle. Sentinels, we saw...